What up everybody, my name is Blue and today I have another video for you guys. Yes, without talking too much of nonsense, we're going straight into the boosters. Now today we have two single blisters, one from Unbroken Bonds with the Pikachu promo and the Poplio coin, as well as the Cosmic Eclipse second one with the Lucario coin and the, the Terrakion. Terrakion promo card, as well as the triple blister with the Hackmo coin and the Wiktini promo, which looks absolutely amazing. But yeah, without that, without further ado, we're going straight into it. We're just gonna rip it all open, and I'm just gonna cut to the point where I'm done with it. All right, now that I have unboxed everything, so we got four boot. No, we we actually got five. I forgot one over here. So we got four Cosmic Eclipse boosters and one unbroken bomb booster pack. Uh, this booster set has the full art trainer card blue in it, which is by far my favorite. I mean, there's red and green as well. Is it green? Yeah, green. I think it's green, damn, I forgot. But yeah, that's a, that's a really interesting set. But with that said, we going to take a look at, at the coins, which we have the Lucario coin first up. Uh, pretty cool coin to me. Uh, I don't know, it's, it's just a coin, dude. <laughs> then we have the Poplio with like the shattered glass uh, kind of artwork thing going on. Pretty cool as well. And we got the Hackamole, which we already have once, which is cool. I like the color they chose for it. But with that said, we're gonna take a look at each promo we actually got. So we got three promos, and I'm gonna quickly check these up. So first off, we have the Pikachu promo. Uh, it's kind of a weird artwork to me, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, it's, it still looks amazingly good with all the sparkles and like that kind of misty, uh, grass theme going around there that's pretty cool and then second we have the Terrakion which looks absolutely amazing too with the like stomp going out there <clears throat> cool card I love the artwork totally on that one then we have Victini which is my favorite artwork of all of these those three which looks absolutely cool with the fire spinning right here going on Victini is really a cool Pokemon at itself it's just like the first mythical that was number one in their respective Pokédex. It was kind of cool. And when they announced it, if you pre-buy it, you get a freaking Victini. Oh, man, <laughs> that probably was the first, the best pre-purchase or pre-order bonus you can get. But yeah, with that said, we're gonna take a look at the boosters. We're gonna first open the Unbroken Bond and then go for the Cosmic Eclipse. And yeah, so let's see what we can get inside. I'm actually really excited to see what we can get because there are so many good cards in this set. Oh yeah, we forgot the other codes. But yeah, this is the first code card, so be sure to follow me on Instagram or hit the bell next to the subscribe button. That way you get notified and you can grab a code first. As well as be sure to subscribe anyway. We are at, hold on, let me check. Oh, wrong one. I'm gonna go and check on my channel just to make sure we are still at 138 which is not bad I mean one day not gaining subscribers is I don't I don't really care I mean you don't always have to like gain 1,000 or 3,000 subs in a day I mean that's ridiculous but yeah with that said, we're starting off with a Thunder Energy, a Dust Island, Golbat, Tentacruel, Caterpie, Clefairy, Poliwag, Ekans, Drowsy, Reverse Slowpoke, and the final card of this Unbroken Booster, Unbroken Bonds Booster is... Ooh! Yes, let's go! We got a Gardevoir and Sylveon GX card. And that card kind of feels weird on top of it, but that's cool. So we got one. We actually pulled something. That's 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 really cool. <laughs> At least we got something, though. You never know. 
if you're gonna pull anything or not so yeah uh, with that booster out of the way we go over the three cold cards we have so this is the first one then we have the second one right here and the third one right here so let me know if you pulled anything good in the TCG online maybe you can get anything cool I don't know I I don't know I feel like if you play the online game and then like uh, get a better card than you pulled in real life it's kind of frustrating because you don't have like physical evidence of what you pulled and for me that's like the the epitome of like when it comes to pulling something out of the booster you can't just like go online and pull something that's like the same with like online car games like Duel Links for example if you know the game I mean Yu-Gi-Oh! Duel Links it's just you know it's just that you don't have the excitement you don't have yeah you're quite excited as well but it's not the same excitement you know I don't know if you if you collect cards you know what I mean if you don't I don't know <laughs> try it yourself but hey I want to quickly talk about this Jolteon artwork this is mind-breaking <laughs> oh my god I love it I absolutely love this artwork oh my god it's 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 almost too yellowish greenish but I love it the artwork is totally worth it do we have a Pangoro a Rapidash which is a really really good artwork as well we have a Deerling <laughs> that's a really cool artwork we have Teddy Orsa with the Arceus uh, monument on the back or statue we got a golet we have a dupider we have a helioptile <laughs> almost looks like a shiny that way uh we have a uh, reverse alolan grimer and the first final card of the uh what is it cosmic eclipse booster is regular rare mars shadow all right well <laughs> nothing really really that good but it's okay we can still we can we can we can still manage something. To, uh, I mean, we can still manage to pull something. I believe. Let's say it like that. <laughs> I believe that we can pull something. Okay, here's the co card. All right, one, two, three, four. Starting off with a psychic type energy, we got a uh, Lana's fishing rod. Really cool artwork there as well. We got Chaotic Swell. What is a swell? Is that like a storm or a tornado or something? We got a Type Null car. Alright, looks pretty cool as well. We got Magnemite. We got Eevee. Flabebe. Really cool artwork there. We got Sneasel. Natu. Reverse Macargo. And the final card is. Oh my god, yes! Another, another one, right? Yeah, we already pulled that, but that's okay. I love to double up so I can trade them in for something else. But we got another Venusaur in Snivy GX, so we are two in five. No, wait, two in four, two in three. How many boosters did we have? Five. So we are two in three. Okay, that's that's pretty good. That's that's really good, actually, to be honest. So, second last booster. We got another co-card right here. Going four from behind as always. <sighs> Starting off with a fighting type energy, Ambipom, Goldock, Will. Actually, I never realized. I, I, I thought it's just a, like a normal dude. But it's actually an Elite Four trainer. I totally forgot about this guy. It's actually the guy from Johto. Um, I think it's he's the replacement for for Agatha, I think. <clears throat> I'm not sure. I, I, I don't really know. But he's an Elite Four trainer. I never realized this until, until I played Pokemon Masters. Then we got Skrelp. We got Pikachu. Stuffle. Poonard. Lit Leo. Reverse Grandpa. Almost looks like the cutout from the anime. And the final card is regular rare Heliolisk. All right, well, nothing in here. Let's go with, this, with the last booster. 
Let's see if we can get anything in here as well. I mean, it would be sick if we can get another polo or four or whatever. But yeah. So, this is the co card. Putting that aside. One, two, three, four. And here we go. So, starting off with a dark type MG attack call. Alright. Search your deck for up to two tag team cards. Alright, pretty easy. <clears throat> Delmice. We got Kotic Swell again. We got Seal or Feel, whatever. Alolan Meowth, Rolls, Pessimian, Jangmo O. <laughs> that looks really cute. Uh, we have a reverse Travenant, and the final card is. Oh, <laughs> yes, let's go, dude. Oh my god, it's another trainer card. It's N with Rashram and Sacrum. Yo, I love this card. Wow, that is some that is some really really good artwork. Oh my god. I love the trainer card. I didn't know that the trainer GX cards are in this set as well. I thought they're I mean it makes sense if you think about it, but damn. I love this card though. <laughs> oh yes, let's go man. Get another really cool card here. I haven't pulled that in a while. Or I haven't even pulled that. <laughs> but I, <laughs> I haven't pulled something really really amazing artwork wise. Uh, that Oh actually well, I mean I did. But I never showed it up. Because I pulled it off screen. Which is the Japanese blue card, or is it green? I don't, I don't really know. But damn, I pulled this card and I freaking, I freaking lost it, dude. It was almost as bad as when I lost it to uh, base set Charizard reprint. But hey, what should I say? Um, but yeah, with that said, we're gonna go and quickly prepare the recap time, and I'll see you guys in a second. Peace. All right, welcome back to the recap time. Here we go. Keep in mind. Uh, well, actually, please cue the music, but keep in mind these are all reverses, but we got some good pulls, I'm just saying, but we're starting off with the reverses, so we got a Travenant reverse, we have a Drampa reverse, we have a Macargo reverse, an Alolan Grimer reverse, a Slowpoke reverse, and then we jump over to the promo cards, which actually look really insane all the time. We got the Pikachu promo from the uh, Unbroken Bonds uh, single blister. Then we got Terrakion with the uh, Cosmic Eclipse single blister as well. And then we have, in my opinion, the best of all three, Victini from the triple blister of Cosmic Eclipse. Looking really good. That's amazing. And that's not all. We actually pulled three other cards which are really good. So first off, we have another Venusaur and Snivy GX, which is really cool. I love it to trade it. Uh, as well as we have a Gardevoir and Sylveon GX, which looks absolutely good. I love this card. And at the end, we have a Sacrum Reshram GX card with N in the back. Absolutely dope. I love this card so much. That's absolutely cool. Well, with that said, guys, I really do hope you enjoyed my video today, and uh, if you did, be sure to subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace! Don't forget, collect them all!